It's been almost a month since floods ravaged homes in Dego Martin, leaving a path of destruction. Many residents have been complaining about a lack of state assistance as they battle to get back on their feet and piece their lives back together. But on Wednesday, some had reason to smile. As Housing Minister Dr. Rudal Munilal distributed grants to assist over 100 persons who were affected at a cost of just over $1 million. Minister Munilal distributed grants ranging from $7,000 to $30,000 from his ministry's emergency fund. Three to six months this will take to assess and do the paperwork. But because they started during the time of the crisis, we are here in quick time to disperse about $1.8 million in checks. So I want to congratulate the Ministry of Housing and the Ministry of the People for this work. The grants are to be used to assist with remedial works to homes which were affected. Minister of State in the Ministry of the People and Social Development, Fanella Allen Toppin admits the grants may not be enough to get them back to the point they were, but she says it can be used as a start. I ask you to accept what we can offer. At this time, we had 17,000 people affected in this area. I'm very sorry that you had to go through what you go through, but let us take it as a lesson. Let us take it as a good lesson for prevention in the future. Chairman of the Dego Martin Regional Corporation, Anthony Sami, notes that while a lot of work has been done to restore the affected area, there is still a lot more to be done. I am Otto Carrington reporting for CNC3 News.